Thanks for staying with us. You're still on to Good Morning Nigeria on the network service of the NTA. It's time for newspaper review. Viewer Chukudi Okolo Baja is in the studio. Good morning, Chukudi. Good morning. And congratulations for Actually, a successful election. I am not state. from a do state. I know you, are, you were before, when, uh, before they now. But when I was there, you, because Benin yes, is, home. Goes, is home. If you see the plantain, the size of it, snails. No, it was it was a glorious place then. Yeah, I, it still I, is. It still, it still is. is. It still is. We have to say congratulations to Bini yes. people in uh, Edo State. Yes. Because all the fears we had would seem to have evaporated. Mm -hmm. Let's get on with it. Uh, yes, Good yeah. morning, so Chooks. Morning, Demo. How are you doing? I'm doing great. Uh, have you forgotten that he's here? Just by looking at my pretty uh, face. Uh, I know. <laughs> I told you you're a major attraction to me here. <laughs> Without uh, intoning anything and, and you know, uh, on to what? Okay, let's go <laughs> quickly to the papers. We're beginning with the leadership newspaper. And above the mass head, we have uh, finally DSS releases and bad governance protesters. You find the details on page six. Again, terrorist bomb 330 kV Damatru Meiduguri power line. You find the details on page 22. And just below the masthead, current petrol pump price still driven by subsidy. How? You read up and find out why. You find the details on page 7. Council polls, APC clears Quara Emo seats. Details on page 7. And a side piece of the headlines in the leadership newspaper, the main story, Nigeria's annual tire import hits. 108 billion naira. You find details on page 21. Coal mine explosion kills 51 in Iran. Details on page 16. Serap six probe of ecological funds. Find that on page six also. Tinubu cracks order cracked down on cybercrime car theft. Details on page six and the picture stories see there APCs of Pueblo floors Igadolo Akpata in Edo governorship. With riders scores 291,667 votes. PDP trolls with 24,274. LP polls 22,761. And police work a basaki out of INEC office. PDP governors kick. And Tinibu Buhari orders hill victory. That's a picture story you see there. Let's quickly go to the Daily Trust newspaper and just below the mass head, Serap urges Tinibu to probe ecological funds spent by for no state government. Details on page 37. Israel orders 45-day closure of Al Jazeera West Bank office. You find that on page 5. Flood, Zulum raises committee to disperse donated funds. You find details on page 8. And a APC's Pueblo wins Edo governorship election. And PDP rejects results. Obasaki calls for calm. Vote buying, disruption of coalition, Ma polls. Tinibu Buhari, Barao Hill, own party's victory. And the picture story you see there, the illustration is something I've read in the leadership newspaper. And uh, petrol is 52 naira per liter in Libya. Details on page 31. And cholera kills 12 in Adamawa. And details on 30, page 37. Military denies detention of naval rating for six years. Details on page 6. Katina celebrates 37th anniversary today. Mr. Adamawa. All right. Thank you, uh, Juma. Uh, I have the Nigerian pilot uh, newspaper uh, with me and uh, just below the name plate we are pdp fault INEC or resort collation alleges massive irregularities details on page six soldiers kill vandals destroy 13 illegal refineries in nigel delta 
uh, that's the details can be found on page four and uh, the current issue which is the APC uh, the Edo gubernatorial election APC wins Edo uh, gubernatorial election as INEC declares his candidates Monday of, of my bolo winner having scored 291 uh, 667 votes and I think uh, Juma you've read uh, the details of yeah, all this yeah. in other newspaper let's move to other stories on the front page of the Nigerian pilot defense headquarters explains role of military in a do Gaba election details of that story can be found on page six uh, the federal government labor sign MOU on consequential salary adjustment that's good news for the um, the workers. Uh, 244 million children globally between the ages of 6 to 18 not in school. Uh, that details can be found on page 5. Uh, Demawa receives 200,000 doses of cholera vaccines from UNICEF. The uh, Oka leaders uh, petition police service commission over Supo Iburu if I his activities. Then probe spending of billions of ecological funds by Bono government, Syrah. The NDLEA arrest 80-year-old grandpa with drugs, oh. intercept 14.9 billion opioids. Details on page 4. Chooks. Did the 80-year-old grandpa know that uh, contraband was on him? Well, Maybe somebody could have taken advantage of him. Because I can't imagine a man who has one foot in the grave... Mm engaging in such grave activity mm. yes it doesn't make sense well, i saw it on the social media yesterday and i wonder what 80 years what was he going to do with the money APC is a I, I think it was caused i mean he confessed selling illicit drugs for the past 25 years so he's been doing oh. the business oh. so, oh. so <laughs> he's oh. been in the business for the past 25 oh. years that's what he said yeah it's a statement on sunday from the agency spokesperson femi baba family stated that the suspect obtained the drugs from bene republic and he's been in the business for the past 25 years mm. Mugbe? Yeah. APC is a governor, it's a do gov governor elect. Mm. You go download, it didn't make it. No, didn't make uh, it. So, what should matter to us in the matter? First of all, was the process free and fair? fair. Does INEC get a pass mark from the exercise? Mm. These are the things that are germane to us. We were able to take results to the INEC portal, that's the IREV. Mm. What are prospects of our being able to take all elections in 2027 to the portal? Maybe real time this time. Mm. These are the things that are. Yeah. But um, I think that at the end of the day, we need to still. Anyway, those game. are the questions that we're asking today, our uh, guests. Wonderful. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So at the end of the day, those state people have to be commended. Mm. All the fears we had. They have come to naught. Yeah. You know, I said the other time, if they don't sign the peace accord, don't vote for them. They are taking <laughs> us for granted. How dare they? You know? But at the end of the day, I think everybody has comported themselves well. Yes, yes. And we say, it well. for now, thanks to INEC for doing um, what seems to be a good job. Uh, PDP is saying there were infractions. Let them prove it if they have a point. That's why I look at it. Current petrol pump price still driven by subsidy. Hmm. Mugwe? I think that's my second Mugwe today. Mm -hmm. Mugwe? I hope it turns out a good day. I don't know which subsidy you. Uh, if. <laughs> Do you know what Mugwe is? Many people don't keep at you. Do you know what Mugwe is? This Mugwe that you are saying, what, I what, what, what is Mugwe? Mugwe, actually, anytime I lifted the, the cane against a, a pupil at Ajanshi uh, Primary School in yeah. the, uh, where I served in Owo. Yeah. Mugbe would get, come from the. What does that actually mean? Mugbe, I'm actually, in trouble. Actually, uh -oh. the next, the next person I lifted the cane on will shout Mokuno, <laughs> <laughs> which means that he, the person don't die. I don't die. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh my God! Well, let them work it out. Nigerians are trudging, but the times are really hard mm. in the face of unearthly fuel prices. Let us pray that. When competition eventually sets in, we are talking about Dangote refinery. We should be talking about nine more private refineries in Nigeria. Mm. Competition will level everything. If you doubt me, ask MTN and Glow. Mm. So that is the ultimate. 
Let's pray to I was it. looking it's at my water. oil gauge this morning and I, you know, I have to psyche myself. Yeah, I know yes. I have to psyche myself, talk to myself before yeah. I go and get fuel. I have to talk to myself. You may calm down. Are you able to get calm fuel? Down. No, I've not gotten fuel yet, but I was looking at the guy. I said, if I'm going to get fuel, I had to tell myself, you may calm down. No, calm that, down. No, it's so, available. No, yes. It's available. You know, uh, it's not the availability, it's the money. It's the money. It's the money. It's the money. It's not the availability. Because I it's drove around yesterday, I couldn't get, I mean. My needle. You is, have to go to the outskirts a bit. My to needle get fuel, is yeah. perpetually yellow, you know, oh. the gauge. Perpetually now. And they say it doesn't help help your fuel pump. It doesn't. You're stressing it, doesn't. it. So you need to tell yourself to calm down. We have to learn calm to calm down. down. Yeah, we have it to It elongates your down. life anyway. <laughs> <laughs> DSS releases and bad, bad governance protesters. I pray that it is gradual movement towards peace with protesters mm. because they had a right to protest. But if, it did, if any of them was found to have done anything against the green, white, green, mm. they should answer for it. Otherwise, those people should not be in and detention get, at all. And they're getting off of 1st October, actually. That's oh, oh, of course, yes. The second yeah, part yeah. of the Let, let's, yeah. say, let's say that it's all a process of shaking hands again. At the end of the day, we are all Nigerians. Yes. That, is the, that is the kind of confession that should be coming from, from us. And we turn that gidiba. I'm not a pastor. <laughs> Let me keep quiet. Terrorists bomb 330 kV. Uh, power line, Damatulu to where is it Meduguri? Not where? again. Not that, again. That's not again. Now, I say this is not a good one. This is 330 KV usually rides on what we call pylons. I was yes. in Nepa, I was in Nepa Star. That's it, that's a 3 KV. Uh, my yeah. job was to work out payment to contractors for mm. clearing the, the shrubbery under the pylons, those uh, steel mm. towers, you know. 330 KV is the highest, it's followed yes, by 132 KV. Yes, yes. Then after that, 33 kV, then 11 kV. Mm. It effectively, effectively knocks out. All the industries. In, in an entire district, region. That is not even my point. At this start. point in time, mm -hmm. when Meduguri is going through a situation like this, yeah. and this happens again. Trouble, me to have. It's really, really, One really shock wave after the Very yeah. unfortunate. Yes. The Ibo man calls it, it never rains, but it pours. Pours. It's, On that it's, note, it's well... Uh, Chooks, we have to draw the cotton. I know. Mm -hmm. I know. This segment of the program. Yeah, thank you so much. Because we have me. these uh, Edo issues that we need to talk about. It's going to be a, a, a full day for you guys. Thank you. Thanks a lot. So we take a break now. Good morning, Nigeria continues. Stay with us.